This is the beginning of week three of the Drive for Innovation, and we timed our um, our Midwest leg just perfectly. It's been 100 degrees every single day and high humidity. So uh, from here we're going up to Detroit, and um, hopefully we will avoid the thunderstorms that are going to roll through Missouri, Illinois, Indiana, all along our our trip. No joy. It doesn't get much better than this. Hurry up, man, we don't have all day. Authority leader Mitch McConnell, who is sort of the linchpin now, the Republican in the Senate. Ian, too close to the TV. Told you, no TV. It's ridiculous. Okay, Ian, we do this every night. This is the last time. I will read you a bedtime story, and that's it. It's been a very long day. Now just relax. We'll read a little bit from your favorite publication, The Wall Street Journal. The Road to Downgrade, a short history of the entitlement state. Even without a debt default, it looks increasingly possible that... What? Okay, how about a little Bill Bryson? There's a little piece that might make you um, pine for home, okay? Let's just try to get to sleep, okay? It's going to be a long day tomorrow. It's been a long day today. Okay, take a deep breath. Something else that was nice and pleasant is gone forever because it wasn't practical, like passenger trains and milk and bottles and corner shops and the Burma Shave signs. And now it's happening in England, too. See? A little local connection. And before long, there will be no more milk bottles delivered to the doorstep or sleepy rural pubs, and the countryside will be mostly dropping shopping centers and theme parks. Forgive me. I don't mean to get upset, but you're taking my world away from me, piece by little piece. And sometimes it just pisses me off.